Well, welcome back, guys, to Road 96. Uh, I know, I know, a lot of a lot of my content recently has been this game, uh, and I do have uh, the other stuff that I'm working on, my other series. Uh, they're just on pause for now, uh, but in the meantime, I've really been enjoying this game. Uh, so thank you for anyone who's watching this. Uh, you know, stick through watching me. Uh, you know, play this game. I know it's probably not as fun as watching me die a thousand times, or uh, me and my friend shit talk each other uh, while we play games. But uh, it's it's still nice to have a say. Oh my god! Okay, that my 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 headset link uh, did did not appreciate me moving it and just buzzed me with static. Do you mind not? Okay. Anyways. Okay, that's... Okay, why? Chill. Anyways, uh, yeah. So, uh, I will have uh, another Halo Legendary mission out soon. Um, yeah, for now. Let's, uh, let's continue. So last time... Hello. We got Hello. fucking Hello. Carmen murdered. The by the Psycho. God damn it. I've learned the brigades have recently attacked two officers transferring a prisoner. The brigades overwhelmed the officers during a refueling stop and released the prisoners. Here tonight is Officer Green, who fortunately survived this brutal attack. Officer Green, can you tell us what happened? Well, me and Officer Thompson were refueling on our way to a more secure facility when we were suddenly attacked by at least 10 brigades. Terrible. These brigades, they're just violent criminals. Is there anything we can do to help? Yeah. If anyone knows anything about the people who did this, or have seen these fugitives, call the Sonya hotline or your local authorities at once. Thank you, Officer Green. My man has news, massive please. sideburns. I've located a source who saw the missing teen I discussed in a previous episode. Let's call him now. Hello, you're on the air. May I ask what your name is? You can call me Gerald. Hello, Gerald. Say hello, everyone. Hello. So, Gerald, you saw the missing teen? Yeah, I gave the kid a ride. Well, tell us more. Looks like the cat's got your tongue. I did want to say something else. Something to you, Sonia. What is it? I'm coming for you. TV folks, let's move on, shall we? Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candy. Oh polls. shit! Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. Tyrak, working against voter registration fraud, is fighting hard against his opponents. Nation, he deserves your full support. As you know, the Sonya Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. Let's go with this one. And that has been the Sonia show. Who's this? Who's this? Who are we gonna be? Jake. That's a very Jake hairstyle. We're gonna go with Jake. I like Jake. Jake's a nice name. Whew, okay. Now it's time to figure out who's Jake's. Uh, uh, bad. I can't speak who Jake is going to be. Well, first we'll have to see who his first character is. July 7th, 1996. Let's get serious. Oh, yo, it's Papa Bear. I'm 
very anti tyrak All my characters are going to be anti tyrak Fuck Tyrak. Yeah, fuck you, Tyrak. Check trash. Oh, money. Hmm. Oh, what it? What is with the whoa? What is with the lighting? Hmm. Car keys. All right. Close that up, and it's almost like we were never there. Shot. Oh god, what are these controls gonna be? Oh, we're so gonna we're so gonna eat shit against Papa Bear. Oh god, okay. Whoa. Whoa! is not in my control at all. Oh, okay, 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 all right. Oh, oh gosh, I'm not in control of this situation at all. Damn. God, I can't control this thing fast enough. There's no way I just scored on myself. Keep asking. Well, this. Okay, I guess I picked the wrong thing. Seen you before? No. My name is Robert Kidd. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I do believe that's a reason you're here today. Maybe you should push on, young bud. It's getting late. Oh, young bud. Oh, it's the alcohol. drugged herself.
ha. Two adults brought a, a teen to 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 a hangout, and he wants to show me something big. The brigade secret hideout. John and I were at the border in '86. Hmm. The brigades have been around for many years. Hmm. We have something special planned for election day. Wait and see. Huh. So it's behind the door. Come on, I'll show you. What's the kid doing here, Robert? The kid's political. Besides, aren't we on the lookout for fresh blood? Mm, I don't know about this extremist shit. I won't say anything. See, he's not gonna say a word. Let me start with a big piece of news. Thanks to Zoe, we have intel showing that Tyrak is behind the collapse. Just oh. like we've always suspected. Oh, shit. I knew he was behind it. Like us, kid. We tried to end his life that day, but he set off the explosives on the peak. Each year, they set it off to prevent avalanches. Must have set off too much in 86. I have some other big news. I have a plan to rig a Tyrak billboard. We'll attract cops to it by broadcasting a fake signal. When they arrive, boom, we trigger the device. This isn't a huge move, but it's a good start. And we'll send that just sounds like terrorism. Do I have any volunteers? I don't like this. If we want a revolution, we need to act. I'll do it, Robert. This isn't who we are. Yeah, They're no. They're sending teens to the work camp, John. Protests aren't cutting it. And Flores sure as hell won't cut it either. Robert's right. We need to attack. Now. Alex, our little genius, will help us rig No, us. no, no, no. If all goes well, he can build us something bigger and badder for election. Uh oh. Uh oh. Get out, Robert. He doesn't want to be involved in this. We don't need Alex. We can find somebody else to do this. I'm telling you all. Violence will do more harm than good. He's right. Don't you think, kid? Why? Funny because John and his girlfriend were the ones who drove the truck to kill Tyrak in 86. I've changed, Robert. Yes, you have. Look, we should vote and settle this right now. Who thinks the brigades need to be more aggressive? I don't. I do. I do. I refrain. I don't. I don't. I do. Free against free. <laughs> the kid. He's here after all. That's why you brought him in. To vote on your side. Incredible. Kid, what do you think? Violence is not the answer. Yes, I did. Otherwise, we'd just become terrorists. The police on their way. We all know what we need to do. Get in our cars and leave calmly. Kid, no need to worry. They'll never suspect you. Hey, kid, want to play? We can put down some money if you want. Uh, yeah, but for fun. Let's play. You're gonna have the god skills that Papa Bear had. Oh, I have lost complete control of the situation. Let's vandalize these before we go. And, uh, yeah, get this car, because we got those keys. Woo! Nice, nice. 1,741 miles from the border. 
Okay, so we just made, like, a, a drastic impact on, like, this entire world. Because we, we kept the, brig- the brigades, the, I can't speak, from becoming terrorists, basically. That, that's, that's what they were becoming, right? Like, they were about to be terrorists. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh, hi! Don't look at us. Okay. Please don't hurt me. Why are you dressed that way? Okay, the gas is being stepped on. Our motor not starting outside the laundromat after we rob it. Humiliating. Uh, you think I don't know that, Stan? It's your fault, you know. My fault? Oh, that's rich, Mitch. So where am I headed again? <laughs> No, thanks. No, no, that's okay. Take the kid. He's clearly a criminal anyway. I'm not. No, I'm not. Hold on. Before we end the best Robin duo ever, let's take a deep breath. Yeah, we shouldn't rush into this. This is big. Taking deep breath is good. Okay. A laundromat robbery. Jeez. Witnesses say the two robbers, both dressed like they were into S and M role playing, argued the entire time. Though the suspects only made off with seventy-two dollars in quarters, they are said to be armed and very dangerous. If you see them, please call the police immediately. They're laughing stocks. And Sony reporting it no less. Oh, jeez. Hmm. I guess we could talk about that. I guess that's it. Stan and Mitch are breaking up. Go on and partner up with the kid. No. I guess that's it. Wow. No. You two should seriously Only reconsider. To, do. to be sure this is the right move, and I'll give what? the kid Mitch's ultimate bank robin quiz. What? What? I don't want to be a robber. I'm trying to get out of here. Get enough questions, right? You and Mitch become Robin partners. But don't. Then Mitch and I have to. I don't want to spell it out. What? Spell it out. Spell it out. Oh no! What the fuck? Question number one. The following. What is the best location to rob? Ah, ah, ah. This one. Yeah, that's the right answer. Oh God! I'm jealous. I will admit, I am very impressed. <laughs> okay. Cool. Great. What the fuck is going on? Question number two. When is the best time to rob? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, after it's dark. Not another one. We won't kill another one. Question three. What is the best getaway vehicle? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, a helicopter. Yeah. Because from inside it, people look like ants. Stan and I were saving up for one. We were point one percent of the way there. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Question four. The final question. What the fuck what is this segment? Thing to do with your money at your hideout? Uh, bounce with it on the bed. Is this your final answer? It is, yeah. Yes, that is 
is the best thing to do. Okay. Not explain why, for obvious reasons. Can we put the shotgun down? The kid passed. Mm. No, I've never even passed it. That's my quiz. So you're not gonna kill me, right? to you. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, why? That was, like, somewhat heartfelt, but, like, also terrifying, because, like, murderous criminals had a shotgun to my face. Why? What was the point? Yo, oh, hello? Hmm. Yo, know, what the dog doing? Are these Tyrak posters? Tyrak posters in good condition, not on my watch. Someone inside, or some shit like that. Yes, I'm just a normal genius, not a genius genius. Yo, depressing. <laughs> Yo, depressing. Hello there. Hey, what are you, a ninja? Yes. What are you doing here? I've been working on this thing for three days straight, but I still can't figure it out. Hmm. Huh. Well, it's a prototype. You can't actually detonate it. Ah. Uh. Sure you should do that? Don't worry. To tell you the truth, I was just kind of curious to see if I could make it. So, uh, protests are really intensifying. Never seen anything like it in all my 14 years. How do they make you feel? I just go to tough for Flores. Could go either way, I guess. Politics are hyper-complicated. Yeah. You're what? FYI, a rubber duck is someone who listens to someone else describe a problem. Okay. If all goes well, the solution presents itself to the person talking. Quack. Cool, cool. So first I check the resistance with my voltmeter, and everything seems okay. Then I clean the captors, checking them too. A bit painstaking, but whatever. I removed every screw, nut, and bolt, and the motherboard. Do you check the electricity? Quack, quack, quack. To turn on the electricity, we need to find the generator. Could be anywhere at this station. Grab this nail gun. I got another idea. Yes! Armed with a weapon. Shoot the tiles to see where it goes. That's how we'll find the generator. Oh. Uh, 
I am definitely doing that. I do not like how I auto aim to him. How, can I? Can I shoot Alex with a nail gun? Can I? Okay, no. Oh. Bang! Oh my god, that actually worked. Oh no, it's gonna. Crap. Oh! Oh! You had the magnet on you the whole time! Oh god. fine with that. Okay, so just the key needs to not touch electricity. Oh my god! Oh god! Oh god! Do you have any other lines than that? God! Really, you don't say what was your first indication of- I am going to kill this character with all of this electricity. Oh my god. Ah. Yeah, so I can't feel any of my bones. I shocked one. Okay. Oh, damn! Whoa, thanks, Alex. See you down the road. Man, we love Alex. Alex is cool. Six 
631 miles to the border. All right. Well, I think with that, that'll be where I end this. Uh, all right. So we got our new guy, Jake, and uh, he didn't die. And he also, uh, he's honestly the most impactful person that we've had so far. Uh, I'm going to return to the main menu before I even know who I'm with. Yeah, there we go. All right. Um, yeah, so far he's been the most influential person. He stopped the brigades from going full, uh, you know, crazy. But we did, we did also learn that it was indeed Tyrak who uh, set off the bombs. Which, I mean, to be honest, he, he's a dictator, so, like, that was just kind of... Yeah, that, 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 that I, I, I should have seen that coming. But, yeah, um... All right, so we'll, uh... I guess as we go along, maybe maybe this is, like, the, 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 the lore character we'll have. Jake can be our lore character. He'll, he'll figure out all the, uh, the secrets and whatnot. I also really hope Alex doesn't make that bomb. That would be very unfortunate if he made a bomb... Would not be very cool. But yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. I know this isn't probably the most exciting thing to watch. I mean, it is a single-player game compared to the chaos of my multiplayer stuff, but I'm I'm really enjoying it, and I hope you guys are too. Uh, if you enjoy my content, as always, feel free to subscribe, like, comment, whatever you want to do, or just watch. Watching in general is good. And uh, I'll see you guys in uh, the next episode of whatever I decide to put out. See ya.